Hello and welcome everybody to the Intricate Effects server. As always, this is one Fred Jones. Today, um, I want to do a little caving for a couple of reasons. Uh, one reason is I want to talk to you guys a little bit, and that should give us a good uh, setting to, to do some chatting. And another reason is we need to light this area up. Uh, we need to light it up down underground here where we are now and up on the surface. So I'm going to talk to you about all that as we're caving, so let's get going. I've already been down here for a little bit now, so um, Monkey Boy and Sigma have also been helping me get this area all lit up. And if you haven't figured it out by now, we have a witch farm. And this is where we're going to live. This is the surprise that I put down on our uh, project in our project book. So we need to get everything all lit up. And Sigma, I have a feeling, has been running around here snagging up all the resources. So I figured we better get down here and get to work. Uh, not that he's not allowed to. Anybody who wants to come over here and cave and get resources and light light up the area, you're more than welcome to. But uh, I want to snag some of these resources before they're all gone. The other thing I want to talk to you guys about, we'll get right into that too. Um, I want to start really promoting my channel. And before I do that, I want to... Let's get a torch in here. The coal we'll come back for later if we need it. We may never come back for it with our blaze rod factory. But, like I was saying, I really I really want to promote, start promoting my channel. Um, I only get like 8 views. 8 or 9 views per video um, anymore. And... A part of the reason why that is is because um, as your channel gets older, if it doesn't take off like super fast right away, YouTube doesn't promote your channel. It kind of stops promoting your channel for for you. So that's that's what's happened to my channel. Um, slowed down. I went from getting you know 40, 50 views to getting you know eight or nine and really the guys that are watching my videos are all people that know me personally so I want to get my channel out there but before I start promoting my channel what I want to do is I really want to step up my game um, I don't want to start promoting a channel that that's you know just mediocre and honestly I think right now uh, most of my content has been mediocre. So, oh, there's a diamond down there. Now, I seen that diamond earlier, and that's why I diverted this water so we could use this as an elevator. But now we got this creeper. But uh, part of stepping up my game is going to be a microphone. Of course, the one I have now is a headset and. Um, as you guys know, my audio is, like, way below where it should be. Geronimo! Haven't been over here yet. Um, if you'll notice in some of my videos, the audio starts out really loud, and then it gets quiet, or, um, there's some parts in the videos where you hear some crackling and stuff. Oh, I seen you. I didn't see you, I heard you. Crackling and stuff like that. So we want to try to get rid of all that. And uh, I went and I bought a new microphone. It's on its way right now. Um, probably not at next episode, but the episode after. Oh, look at that. That's funny. I will have that new microphone up and going. Of course, I'll have some more, uh, some settings and stuff to mess with. Um, so it's not going to be perfect right off the bat. But it should improve the audio quality quite a bit. And then some of the other things I need to work on is I do get really nervous. I don't know why I do, 
But I get really nervous when I'm recording. There's our diamonds. Yay, diamonds. It's probably only like two, but... Yeah, I do. I get really, really nervous. And, uh, you know, I, I don't say what I want to say or I forget what I'm trying to talk about. Or I get distracted really easily. When normally, um, I wouldn't get nearly as distracted as, as easily if I wasn't so nervous. So that's some of the things I want to work on. I don't know why I get so nervous because um, I don't I tell these guys to hold on. Oops. Um, I might record some blitz here in a little bit. If you notice in chat here, he's talking about going to play some bits, some blitz. Um, I can blitz and. See, here we are. I'm nervous, so I can't type. Record. Ing. There we go. Um, back to what I was saying. Yeah, so I don't know why I get so nervous. I mean, there's only, again, eight people, nine people watching my videos. Um, and like I said, there are people that I already know. And most of them know what I look like, so... Uh, only the guys on the server like Sigma and, well, everybody on the server who watches my videos, they don't know what I look like except for Monkey Boy, of course, he's my brother. Um, he's not talking to me. Um, watch there be lava underneath these. And see, again, I'm here talking and um, 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 um. So that's another thing I want to work on, you know, not being so nervous. That's probably one of my biggest problems. I get nervous and then I don't really um, get out what I want to say or I can't explain stuff very well. This game is amazing. There's so many cool things to this game and, um, I, and, um, and I've spent a lot of time... Um, learning how to play it and I want to share this stuff with you guys but again I get so nervous and I can't I can't talk so that's of course one of the things I need to work on and uh, if you guys have any suggestions and that's another thing that I really really want to emphasize here today is that even the guys on the server if you guys are watching my video and you see something I can improve on do not hesitate to tell me you're not gonna hurt my feelings um, all you're gonna do is help me a lot of people they don't want feedback unless they ask for it you know will they feel like I've heard a lot of guys say well don't don't tell me what's bad about this or what's bad about that unless I ask ask you to tell me well I'm asking you so ooh on fire not on fire so and I say so a lot too um, one of the things I want to do, though, with my channel as well, is I really want to start doing a lot more survival games. Get that water right there. Do a lot more survival games. I think that's fun stuff. If you guys like watching people play survival games, you know, let me know. Give me some feedback. Oh, what's this? That's kind of cool. Huh? Little hidden passageway. Oh, I forgot about that other one over there. We'll get back to that one here in a second. So you can find some more diamonds. Of course, I'm on fire now. And there's a creeper. And he's going to blow me up. That was weird. I couldn't hardly see what was going on there. Oh, wow. All kinds of secret areas. I'm going to miss all kinds of stuff in here, aren't I? So maybe today when I jump over and play some, some Blitz with Sigma Monkey Boy, I'll try to record some of that. Um, if you guys are subscribed to anybody else on the server just about, you know that they're playing UHC and you also know that I played UHC with them. And uh, I didn't upload anything. Well, the reason why is because I had a problem with my video. 
which normally I have audio problems, but this time I had a video problem. I must have hit the wrong button and Fraps stopped recording the video. So all I've got is the Skype call, which, well, I've got game sounds and me commentating, uh, but no video is what ended up happening. So instead of uploading, see there's going to be all kinds of crazy mobs in here because most of this area is lit up. Yeah, look at all these guys. Oh, you probably can't see them. But they're coming at us now. Die. And then I also died the other day when Sigma and Monkey Boy and I were all over here uh, lighting up the area, or lighting up underground. There's a abandoned mine shaft over there, and I got caught in that abandoned mine shaft with a whole horde of zombies like this. And then I died. And, um,. Oh, I don't have any torches on my bar. Then I died, and, um, Monkey Boy, where'd that guy come from? This guy's irritating the crap out of me. I'm not even going to try to shoot him. Hello? Um, die? Stay alive? Just give me an opportunity to get some more stuff on my bar here, maybe. How did he not die? He's like, I hit him with the sword ten times. Now he did. Now he did. But I died and I lost all of my good stuff. All my good pick set pickaxes. I had my fortune pickaxe. I had my silk touch pickaxe. I had all my good stuff on me. And they were unable to... only thing I didn't have on me was my diamond armor. Oh, that's what they're falling out of up there. Good night. Yeah, the only thing that I didn't have on me that, of my good stuff was my diamond armor. So I wasn't too upset about my armor, but I lost my sword, my good bow, three good pickaxes. I don't know why I had three pickaxes on me, but I did. I don't want that bow. I don't really want that spider eye either. Um, dang it. There's quite a bit of cave up there, isn't there? Okay. Maybe this isn't the best place to be while I'm yapping. I'll go back this direction. Alright, I've had enough of you. So let's go back this direction. So I spent a ton of time at the blaze spawner. Um getting a bunch of XP up so I could re-enchant a bunch of stuff. Yeah, there's tons of mobs around here. It's just going to get harder and harder the more we light this stuff up. It's just going to get harder and harder. So I'm just going to go ahead and head back up to the top and probably show you guys the witch hut at this time. I pretty much told you guys everything I wanted to talk about. Oh, no, let's go up here. That might take us back around to where we were. Yeah, there's all these little no it doesn't. All these little cubby holes that need all need to be lit up for this witch farm to really work well. Um, and we I can tell we're doing a pretty good job of getting everything lit up because when you do find a dark area, it is full of mobs. Let's get a torch in here. Alright, well, I'm going to come back for all these resources later. Right now, I'm just going to go show you guys the witch farm and kind of give you an idea of what plans I have for it right now. Or for our home, you know, because it's going to be our home. What kind of plans I want to do. We're going to have everything you can imagine over here. Am I in the right spot? No, I'm in the wrong ravine. A little bit lost here for a second. You know, my plans are to... That's where we need to go, isn't it? It is. To have, you know, a fully loaded base. Everything you can imagine. 
and we're, we'll have like horse timer, horse tracks, um, I mean, stuff for days. Oops, stay in the water. Uh, we've got a ton of spawners around here. We could build all kinds of XP farms. We could build, one of the things I've been thinking about doing is building an arena or like uh, an amusement park with an arena in it. I don't know. Uh, we can do all this stuff out here. I don't know, maybe if we do an amusement park, we want to do it in a more centralized location. So maybe we'll do that closer to spawn. But we could definitely do a horse. Well, I don't know. Maybe the horse track needs to be at spawn as well with an arena. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure all that good stuff out. I'm going to go up here. If we get... Oh. Yeah, up some more. And see, like, the more I talk now, um, the more comfortable I actually am talking to you guys. I still hear zombies, though. Bunch of them. Hey, look over there. Look at all those guys. Yeah, there they are falling out of there. Oh, that's all stuff we're going to have to get cleared, cleared, cleared up, lit, lit up. But yeah, even now, um, the more I talk to you guys, the more comfortable I get. I don't know if you can note if you notice, like in my voice and and how I'm talking and stuff. So maybe that's just what I need to do. I just really need to practice talking um, on camera. Just you know, push record and and do what I'm doing. Where did that guy fall from? Must be daytime on the surface because they are coming out. Oh, look at all that. Yeah, there's so much to explore down here and light up. Um, I'll show you a trick that Sigma showed me. I'll just show it to you guys real quick. If you take two fences, this is kind of cheaty, I know, but... Oh, where you come from? I'll have to go kill this guy. Oh, Lord. Where are these guys coming from? It's pretty much all lit up over here. I don't understand. It's all right. Let me just show you this real quick. Kind of cheaty, but when you're doing something like this, you want to be completely and totally, totally thorough with what you're doing. X-ray. So, of course, this is, you know, you have to do, you have to find it. There's that Ben in mine shaft. But you have to find a good spot to be able to see the dark spots. Um, I was all down in there. That's about level 13. No, that's about a level level 11 right there. All this there. Um, yeah, I was all up there. But this is how we find the dark spots. Like, that's dark. We got to get that lit up. Got to get that lit up. Got to get all that lit up. So on and so forth. There's nothing really below us right here, I don't think, that we need to light up, but said so it's kind of cheaty, but when you're doing something like this, you just really want to be completely and totally thorough with what you're doing. And I don't have an axe on me either, so. Don't want to use my sword. But yeah, let's go check out the witch farm now. Um, well, we're almost to the top. I was going to cut, but we're almost all the way up now, so. Get this XP. Or this. There's a whole bunch of them coming out of here. There must be a dark spot back here. Let's go see if we can find this dark spot. If it's a big open area, I'm not going to mess with it. I think it is. Die. Oh, yeah, look at that. Holy moly. Yeah, that's how we know we're getting most of this lit up. Because you find a dark spot. Wow. I don't want that potato anyways. Boom. Here we are. So if you'll notice, there's not that much land around here. It's a swamp. There's a lot of water. 
this over here, this island we're on right now, is probably where we're going to build the main part of the house. And where it is in relation to the witch hut, I'll show you guys right now. A lot of this, though, we're going to flood. Um, we'll take out this island right here that I'm looking at right now. That island there, all the little islands around, we'll take those out. Monkey Boy said he'd help us do all that stuff, so that'll be cool. Let's go this way. And then our witch hut's right over here. Yeah, Monkey Boy found this thing uh, whenever he was doing the map for spawn. So he found it, and if you'll notice, there's like no land over there, it's all ocean. I mean, if you go far enough in that direction, you do run into a forest, and then I think there may be, um, I don't know, there's like a hills biome, extreme hills biome that direction, I'm not sure. We can get in a boat and go check it out, but I'm not going to, I'm not going to do all that. But, this is going to be awesome. So, th right here will be our witch hut. We'll live on that island over there, not this first one, but that one over there, and then, um, we can, you know, set up our main base over there, and then we can also build stuff out in the ocean as well. All kinds of different cool stuff. But we mainly just want to be close enough to this witch hut to where it'll continually spawn witches once we get it all set up. And, um, you know, we needed a place to live anyways, and I've got some really good ideas for building out here in the ocean. Should be really cool. But uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and call this the end of the episode. I want to thank you guys for watching, and uh, if you liked the episode, hit a like. Uh, also, you can you can help me promote my channel as well. Um, if if you share this video, or you want to put it up on your Facebook page, or um, whatever you may want to do, and maybe not this video per se, but if you find a video that you really like of mine, don't hesitate to um, put it up on Facebook. And hit that like button if you do like it. Again, if you don't like, or if you didn't really enjoy the video, I don't want I don't want any uh, I don't want you guys to like it if you didn't like it. Um, and of course, I don't want you sharing it if you didn't like it as well. Um, only endorse the stuff that you guys like, and that I think that should go with everything that you guys watch, all YouTube um, videos that you watch. Uh, you shouldn't shouldn't like a video just because the guy asked you to like the video. Um, only like the videos if you like it, if you honestly like it. So, having said all of that, I want to thank you guys, and uh, have a good night.